Um, so you previously described yourself as a certified bad bitch. Bad bitch. Twenty four seven. Do you well, fucking, no days off? Do you like fucking slay? Like you got mad bitches because you're a certified bad bitch. Can I do you be got honest? mad bitches? <laughs> No, I feel you, like I'm somewhat retired. What do you, okay, wait, wait. Let me finish, let me finish I, before I answer. Of course. This. You of course. Finish, I'm sorry. Do you get mad bitches? As in like. And by the way, are you? Do you who do you go for? Who do you go, guys what, or girls? Guys, girls, or both. Both. I like boys. I like, like men. Okay, you like men. I'm okay. actually. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. Because when I drink, like, I'm I'm personally like I don't like vagina, but like I'm down to play with some ass and titties. Like, that's okay. Fun. All right. That's why it. I asked Kiko. <laughs> Get it. What? That's okay. why I asked Kiko. So about your sexuality. So really. like, I don't know. I kind of get the impression. Like, I feel like you got game. So like, do you get mad bitches? Uh, honestly, yes. However, let me clarify something. Do am I? I I feel like the older that I'm getting, I'm washing them away. Why? Because I'm getting older. I want a man who well, loves me 23? openly. You're 23. Yeah, I'm 23. You're 23. But you got like, plenty honestly, of time to, to but, no. sow okay. the wild oats. Let's be. Is that how that goes? Let's spill the tea real know. quick, okay? Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> let's spill the tea. My experiences from dating are way more different than theirs. I'm a trans girl. Like, men, honestly, like, it's so fucking rare that you ever even find a guy that's being like, let me take you out. Let's go see a movie. Let's go have dinner. No, they're just trying to fuck. They I'm a fetish. Want- I'm a fetish to like 98% of those fucking guys. Mm. You know? So my thing right now is like, okay, yeah, sexually, I can probably have whatever the fucking guy I want to. You sure but about that? <laughs> no, honestly, like there has not, I'm going to be 100% honest. Like if I genuinely like that guy or if I like, oh, like, you know what? There's nothing godly about it. Yeah. Not you. Sorry. Um, so Sorry. like if I'm attracted to them sexually, like there's I've ninety like ninety five percent of the time I'll get it. However, I'm getting to a certain age now, like a level of maturity, where it's like, okay, sex is just sex at this point. I want intimacy and I want it outside of closed doors. Yep. You, you want uh something that's not shallow and superficial. You want more than just sex. Yeah, like yeah. I, 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 yep. Like I crave intimacy. Like, and honestly, like, I that's something that I want long term. And, and I'm, I'm at a level of maturity. Like I said, I'm clearing the fucking roster. I don't give a fuck if you're huh. a fucking football player, if you know so and so person, if you know X, Y, and Z. Like, I don't give a fuck. Like, Cle- clearing the roster. What do you mean by by that? Do you have confirm do you have, or deny? Do you have, do you have blue it, checks there a roster? in your DMs? Yeah. You just running through famous dudes. I wouldn't, I'm not going to be like talking about, like, yeah, I have hundreds, but I have like a good amount. But you said a roster. So like, what question for you, what's the most amount of people that you've dated? All at once? All at once. Like in rotation? Sure. Same time, rotation, however um, you want to. Honestly, like three. In oh, rotation. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, like I'll have men. I'm like, okay, this one's annoying me. Like, okay, it's time to clear his ass and let's bench this person right there. <laughs> Do you meet men like March Madness out here? Honestly, <laughs> can I go okay, So I did the dating app thing. Like I said, it was a full fetish. Like that's all it was. So I did you put it on up. your sorry. So how did, do they know that you're trans? Yes. That's what I was gonna ask. 100%. Do you put it out there? I don't care how passable you are. I feel like you have to disclose. Respect, respect. And this is why. Very because important. Because they're especially like, ding. Like, like there's like, okay, let's say I go out on a guy and the sec- and honestly, you know, I'm gonna talk about this right now. At my, at my job. Do it, let's go. No, at my job, I had an experience with an old coworker. I'm not gonna say my, my, what, I, what my real job is. Say his is. full name. No. no. <laughs> What's his social, I'm social not security? not gonna say his name. But I, I got offended because long story short, he basically said that if he went on like a, a date with a trans girl and he didn't know that she was trans and she is like a fucking baddie, like I'm talking ass, titties, like operating, you can not even fucking tell. Like this is the baddest bitch. And he found out that she was trans he Jeez. said that he would feel the need to bring out his weapon. Oh. Exactly. So it's so, a safety issue. Yeah. It's a safety issue. Like, yeah. it doesn't matter what you are. Like, I feel like you can be the most cuntiest, like, fucking bad bitchery, like, passable girl. I feel like you have to disclose. And I get it. Some girls, like, it kind of comes into a pride thing, too, with trans girls. It's like, well, I worked so hard to get to my womanhood and blah, 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 blah. I get that, and I fully respect it, like, whatever you want to be stealth. But when it comes to a man, and especially in dating, and this, like I said, this is my opinion. 
And, and like, if any other like trans in, girls are watching, the, or or if any other mic. trans girls are watching, any of the dolls are watching, hit my DMs because, and if I'm saying something that's misinforming, <laughs> educate me because I'm totally open to that. But I feel like when you're one of the dolls, you have to disclose when it comes to dating because this is how there's things like murders, violence, you know, X, Y, and Z. This is how trans girls like end up in sticky situations nine times out of ten because they don't disclose. However, I will say though that being in the social scene, I can walk into a bar and I'm the most confident bitch ever. A man will still go out of his way. And these are the Shit. ones that I'm talking about that are like little closets or whatever you want to call them. They're like, tranny. I, I agree. <laughs> I've heard I've heard the same thing yeah. from some of my friends. They're like, but if I found what? out, because I went to Thailand and they're like, bro, like the lady boys, whatever. I didn't do anything. No, oh, that, that, no that, I mean, but they're like, if I, if I found out that, because a lot of them are really believable. Like they get their no, Adam's gorgeous. apple shaved down. They get their dick cut off. <laughs> Like, they get everything <laughs> Fine, done. Bro. And yeah. I've heard the same thing from, like, a couple of my friends. They're like, yeah, like, I'm, like, I'm swinging if I find out that. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, so, so in a, in, no, I, I'm agreeing I, with you. Yeah. I'm agreeing with you. This San is why I fully oh. always recommend to the dolls, to all of my trans girls, even trans men, like, anybody, whether got it's a situation like that, you have to gotta, disclose. Got to disclose. I 100%. Good. Like, even I, when yep. it comes to dating apps, like, you ask me if I put in there, hell yeah, I do. The Mad fuck? respect to like, you. You're Mad not, respect. I'm not going to risk myself fucking being in a situation where something stupid could happen to me over something that, one, I could have easily prevented, and two, because I don't want to spend my time with somebody who's ignorant or right. who doesn't agree with me, then that's on them. I respect your opinion, but you know what? It's not <laughs> worth my time. That's no personal responsibility that us conservatives love. Honestly, what's funny? Yeah, <laughs> yeah honestly, no, yours are being really No, like you're being rude. Right I'm now. talking about a big situation. And you talk about side converse and sidebars, and <laughs> you're, right. you're laughing at her no, this whole time. We're it's not, really I'm, fucking rude. No, like, let's was, talk about it. Like, we're going to have to say that. No, yeah, it's like, really I'm genuinely, rude. I'm not saying that. No, I, 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 hey, hey, listen. I'm listen. not saying this to be confrontational, but, like, I, I'm all also. for people having opinions and, and fully respecting them. But I'm not going to deal with the side laughing because it's not okay. It's really rude. It's not professional Because I'm 100% open to hearing Don't, your point of view on things. No. That's you, totally fair. You act hey, like we, this big we, old we Christian not laughing at you. man of God. I, I don't think a man of God would conduct himself this way. I'm sorry. There's certain ways to show face. If you want to go Don't, laugh about it in your private Don't doors. Don't project onto me what okay, you think a guys, man of God would do. Uh, I just want to say for the record, I respect you Sorry. saying that you disclose that. I think that's a very good thing and I think that that's healthy nice for thing. society and I think that more trans people absolutely should do that so that we can minimize violence because I don't think violence mm -hmm. is, a, is, is a good way to deal with anything in this realm at all. Mm -hmm. And I, I think what you're saying is, is, is good in that aspect. No, and also let me just finish something by <clears throat> saying that. I'm not also saying that, 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 that trans girls only get hate crime or whatever violence or whatever just because of that they get hate crime as well because of other shit too yeah but that which is i don't one, support don't that support is just that. one of the things that that it's preventable it's a preventable one that's a preventable one from happening yeah. to us it's preventable yeah, yeah. that was and, my and, whole and point and of that again i, I respect you disclosing that and i also i want to i want to state for the record that. i don't support violence against trans mm -hmm. people i don't think that's a good thing violence is wrong i'm glad we can all agree on that no, don't hurt people for no reason but don't fucking play with me because you'll Okay, <laughs> so the, the original Wait, question. Have you, ever, have, you ever, have you ever fucked someone up who like was like, yo, I hate trans people, and they were like trying to no, get violent with you? No, if I'm being 100% honest, like, I don't give a fuck what people's opinions are. Like, I'm the baddest bitch. You can't change my fucking mind. Yeah, maybe come out as delusional, but I don't give a fuck what the fuck else is. You think I dress like this and, and have fucking 40-inch weave in my head and just fake lashes in for a <laughs> man? Absolutely not. I do it because, you know what? I feel beautiful, <laughs> and with or without it, and like... I don't give a fuck. Period. Like, one thing you're may, not going to do, though, is play with me in my face. May, may I ask a question? Don't play with me in my face like that because that's when it becomes an issue. And that's supposed for anybody because, you know what? I'm the most patient person ever. I don't care if we're at the club or at dinner whatever. I'll let some shit slide. But if it keeps on going... She's been very patient. Nah, so you quit fucking playing with me because that's why you're playing with my face. She's been very patient. So okay, point, point taken. I have a question for you, if I may ask. Yeah. Are you on hormones? Yes. How long have you been on hormones? Since I was 19, 20. How do you feel like it's changed you as a person? Um, I'm a lot more emotional. However, I feel like it also made me a little more strong-minded. How so? I'm not as much of a crybaby as I used to be. Really? Got it. Okay, so the original point was, or the initial question was, we were talking about body count, and I was basically just going around <laughs> asking, somebody knocking? Somebody knock? Might be one of your neighbors. Sounds like it's one of your neighbors. Yeah, it's the wall. Is it the wall? I don't know. Um, something. Oops. 
Eric, do you want to check on it? Uh, no, don't, don't open the door. <coughs> Eric, don't open the door. I won't open that. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so, are you, why are you checking, Eric? Uh, 